Uh, good evening. So uh, I've ordered a Mito pistol, PCP pistol from the Wolfman, and I've decided I was going to put a red dot on it because obviously it's a pistol, target pistol, but also it's got to come with the stock. So I, I like something, and I don't really want to put a sight, a proper scope on it. So I went for a red dot, and I picked this up from Amazon, and I, you know, we had lots of good reviews. Uh, four point eight thousand, four thousand eight hundred people rated it four and a half stars. So it's a company called uh, Goatland, G-O-E-T Land. It's a German company, obviously made in China. So I thought I'd give it a go. So uh, yeah, it's a 30 mil red dot. So I shall do a quick unboxing review. And then obviously when I get my pistol and I get a chance to run her, I'll find out how to open it, that's it, open her up. And I'll show you what's in the, in the box. So it comes with a sheet which is a, like a manual but it doesn't actually cover the actual red dot this is a, like for a scope okay so that's pretty useless but what it does tell you it does tell you that the actual battery needs are 2032 because obviously nowadays they don't come with batteries it will do with po uh, uh, sending batteries through the mail so it comes in a bag like this yeah uh, it comes with a obviously the cleaning cloth they all come with cleaning cloths and I'm just going to Take it out of wrapping, well wrapped up. And it's a, a 20 mil weaver or dovetail, and not 20 mil dovetail, 20 mil weaver Picatinny. So that's the actual uh, rails like that. Standard, we can see it's in this light, it's not very really good. Okay, uh, two locking nuts there. Uh, seems really well made. It's, it is solid, it's all, all piece of aluminium. Caps for wind and elevation, they are actually alloy, which is nice. A lot more plastic, but these are nice alloy caps. We'll just whip these off a minute and I'll show you the actual adjusters. So they've got little light like, screwdriver adjusting points here. Yeah, that's for your elevation, that's for your windage. Uh, this is your illumination. So what you've got, you've got five brightness illuminations for each colour. You've got red and green and they just rotate through them. So there's no space in between them, you just rotate through them. And the actual bright, the five, the brightest, is actually very bright, yeah. It also comes with some nice little flip-ups, which is quite nice. So you don't have to worry about getting your, your lenses, you know, covered in dirt. You can put your flip-ups up and down. So yeah, do I like it? Uh, I think it's actually really well made. Um, the actual light, the dot looks pretty bright and it's, and it's sort of nice and sharp as well. Uh, it's, it's larger than most dots, I think it's 5mOA. Five, five so it's bigger than some, but the thing is it, it's bright enough to shoot in sunlight where I don't think you will lose on on the highest brightness where some some dots aren't particularly bright and if you're shooting in the summer where you've got uh, sunlight, you you lose the dot, don't you, in the sun. In the sun. Okay, uh, battery goes in the top, so this is your 2032, which I shall just show you. I've actually put one in myself, I've got quite a few of these. So your battery goes in there. I might even be able to show you the actual dot if I just open the flip ups and turn it on uh, right way around there you go I don't know if you'll be able to see this uh, I'm sure you get a view for it that's it you can just see it so I'm just writing this is the red one just rotating through it so that's the brightest red then you turn off and it goes to the green it rotates with the green so it's pretty bright and uh, you know I don't think you're going to lose that in the actual sunlight at all. Uh, it's got a mirrored front lens, yep, so you know which way it goes on. So yeah, build quality, and this was like 18, 18 quid, which is cheaper than a lot of the, those sort of things. It's also got some little rubber seals on the actual end of the caps, yeah. So obviously when you put your caps back on, it does seal, so it should keep the moisture out, which is really nice. So yeah, uh, we'll uh, see what it's like. We'll put it on the, uh, the Mito, when the Mito arrives. Zero up and uh, we'll find out how accurate it is. So I hope you like that little unboxing video. Take care and thanks for watching.